The age of analytics, an idea that took the baseball world by storm in the mid-2000s, made popular by the Hollywood film Moneyball. Got to think differently. Chronicling the 2002 Oakland Athletics' unlikely journey to the playoffs. This hiring, it seems like, is more than just the Twins. It's about a new era in baseball, it seems. Yeah, the game isn't changing. The game has changed. Lavelle Neal has seen plenty of change in his 30 years covering the Twins, but says analytics isn't a passing trend. We're watching relievers pitch an inning before the starter actually enters the game. We're seeing all the shifts. You know, we're seeing platoons. Using calculations to get the best out of your players. Neil says few coaches show more promise in this new philosophy than newly hired Twins manager Rocco Beldelli, who helped a decimated Tampa Bay Rays team win 90 games last season. But unlike some, Neil says Beldelli still sees the human element in his players. The Twins have talked about this, is not having robots on the field and not having uh, analytics being a driving force. They have a blend. Mixing old school with new school, learning from the likes of Tom Kelly. Ron Gardenhire and Paul Molitor, who've manned the helm these last 32 seasons, but also bringing in a fresh perspective. Rocco Baldelli's 37 years old. He's going to look like a player standing in the dugout there. Acting more like an older brother than a father figure, something Twins management is hoping will finally bring young stars like Byron Buxton and Miguel Sano to the next level. And being the youngest coach currently in the league, Baldelli may just be the man to do it. This is going to be a very interesting offseason, and this is just the first move. In Minneapolis, Gordon Severson, Carol Evan News. Well, Baldelli will be the youngest manager in baseball next year, but he's not the youngest in Twins history. Tom Kelly was 35 years old when he took over in 1986. And of course, we all know he took a young Twins team to the World Series in 1987.